we're back and we yes, are yeah. so thankful to be oh. here this week. Well, I'm thankful to be here anytime, <laughs> to be vertical and be in good health, able to drive and, and get around and do what I want in my pink palace and my home in general. That's I've got awesome. a lot of things to be thankful for, even though I probably won't celebrate Thanksgiving. And that's that's all right. We'll catch it next year, won't we? Absolutely. So we, we're not able to celebrate together this year because it's, yeah. it's a different year with COVID. But there's so much to be thankful oh. for. And I love what you said, Mom. Just in a couple of sentences, you covered a lot. Like, you're thankful for your health. Let's just start yeah. there. Oh, we're thankful yeah. a vaccine or several vaccines oh. are coming soon. Yeah. So we actually see a light at the end of this year and yeah. all that's happening from a health right. standpoint, from a safety standpoint. So that's certainly oh. something to be thankful for. And look at you. I think yeah. you've got a birthday coming up. Oh, geez. and you uh, have I to mention that, Julie. <laughs> you love uh -huh. to get everybody my age. I think the world knows it by now, don't they? I think it's something to be proud of. You are so healthy and, wow. and just incredible. And we're, we don't like to talk about age. I realize it. And I don't. I had a little, I had a little birthday yesterday. So. Yeah. Yes, you were, well, Julie, you were the biggest, I, I'm not going to say the biggest turkey, but you were one big blessing on Thanksgiving years ago. I won't mention how many years, but it, just to have you born on Thanksgiving, dear, I mean, that was so special. I was and a turkey. I was a Thanksgiving baby that year. Yes, I'm yes. 50. Five. You were, and not, uh, I know you ignore my age, Mom, because you think it makes you seem older. But no, no, yeah, I'm, really. I'm the youngest. I'm 55, turned yesterday, and yeah. one of the things that I'm really thankful for is the new people God continues to put in my life. Oh it's yes. Crazy. So I'm, I um, I have a very full life and so many wonderful friends dating back to high school that oh, I still yeah. stay connected. Yeah. A bunch of them from college, and then through the last. Several years, just new people I continue to meet. But then here I am in Florida, and I have a whole new Florida family. And I and got to weren't they yesterday. celebrating your birthday? Yes. You? I thought you'd be alone. But, Julie, you had all these new friends that treated you all day long. Yeah, and it was so I fun. was so happy for you, dear. And I felt very loved. I yeah. uh, was kayaking, so I'm, I'm my initiation into being a Floridian is begun, and it yeah. was so much fun. And we were outside; everything we did was outside, social distance. Good. And, um, Good. Yeah. But and then went to my favorite restaurant for dinner. Yeah. And it just was a really nice day. I felt very loved. Thank you all for the texts, yeah. for the emails, for the Facebook messages, the flowers, the strawberry, like I was, things were showing up all day. It was pretty cool. So well, it just was wonderful. So I'm very thankful because I know. You know life continues to surprise me. And I just, I know. like I said, all these new people, I have such wonderful friends who are like family already. Yeah. And then God keeps sending new people. So I'm really thankful God, for our God relationship. special people in our lives. Yes. And I'm fortunate that way too, Julie. Yes. I really don't have friends from high school. Uh, unfortunately, my good buddies from then are, are gone. Uh, yeah. They're they're with God already. Mm -hmm. But I have new friends too, and I treasure them. You know, our life would be empty without them, Julie. Yeah, so absolutely. there's many things we're going to thank God for, not only Thursday, but every day here. Amen. And, I love that. Every day is an attitude. That was my devotion today. I talked about thankfulness. Yes. Every yes. single day. And it's really an attitude and a lifestyle. And it living is. with the perspective of even when what we consider bad things happening, to see the good. To oh. have a perspective of, okay, God, how are you going to use this? And I love, I love this song by Laura Story. It's called Blessings. And oh, it's yeah. about blessings coming through raindrops and teardrops and oh, how the, yeah. how, how good things can come of sometimes some of our most difficult 
times and most challenging yeah. times. And certainly this year has been that time for many, uh -huh. many people. So We've really been tested this year, Julie. Yes. And I'm happy to report that the people I know have taken it, mm -hmm. taken it on. They have carried on and we're all looking for the end of that tunnel. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm so proud of so many people who've had to, to be alone, right. not be able to get out, not have much family around. I mean, those are the people that have had it so hard, honey. I know, the and, and those who have so been sick and come back. Oh, we, I tell you, every morning, there's so much to thank God for. Mm -hmm. And, you know, even during the day, I, I don't know, Julie, how anyone could live without their faith because it carries us along even through this terrible pandemic. Yes. And it's it's making us happy, looking forward to the vaccine. Oh, I, I'm telling you, we have we have so much, honey. So much to be thankful and, and yeah. You know, I think, too, what this time has done is it's made us appreciate the little things, maybe things we used to take for granted, even just oh. like going to the movies, yeah. <laughs> you know, yeah. the normal stuff that we would just do. Now it's kind of like a big deal. Oh, we, we yeah. get to do this. Well, it's, a, it's a, something special. You yes. know, I think one of the biggest blessings when I think of thankfulness through COVID um, is that I got to see my kids That's and uh, yeah. they both came home because of um, the pandemic. And so right. we have a lot of quality time. I think a lot of families can relate to that, the, the quality time they've had together, maybe some too much time with kids home now from school. <laughs> well, that, that's a little rough, yeah. but, but I think we're going to look well, back. They were challenged. Here. And yeah, I think I, most of them made it through all right. Right. And it well, was now great. We're, we're kind of in the final mile now because now yeah. kids are back yeah. home. School is, for many people, yeah. back home. And so we just have to keep hanging on and oh. just look for that gratitude, that thing to yeah. be thankful for. And we'd like to ask our audience right now in the feed, yeah. if, let us know what are you most thankful for this week and through even through this difficult yes. challenge. Year. We'd love to hear, what are you most thankful for? And I'm just, my answer to that would be the new relationships. For me, it's always yeah. about relationships. I know. And, and, and also being able to build them through technology. I'm very yeah. thankful for technology. Yeah. I mean, oh, I'm thankful for isolation. that too, Julie. I've been there. <laughs> you know how I started out with technology. I know. I'm thankful. For you and technology, because I think I was calling you every five minutes, but we made there it through. Yes. Made it through. Made it through. And, and you know what, Mom? Royal, which is Mom's old typewriter, that's what yeah. the typewriter's name is. Yeah. We couldn't do this on Royal, by the way. No. The typewriter <laughs> had to go for you to make it to the next step. I know. For us to be able to communicate through technology. So I'm so proud of you and how you're tackling yeah. all these technology issues so yeah. that we can connect and we can be together, yeah. at least online. Yes, that's right. And I want to keep growing and going. I, I don't want this to be the end of, of what I'm learning. That was one of our other words. Right. But right. that's how how wonderful God is. He doesn't say you can stop at a certain age, right. retire. Who wants to retire? I want to keep <laughs> going and, and keep adding new blessings to not only my life, but others. Right. I'm already planning to go back to the Follies when we can mm -hmm. and maybe give them a new show. And you know, how's the, How are the tap dancing lessons going? I know you've had them in my what, garage, but how's your practice going in the bathroom? Yeah. I, I'm practicing. I haven't got it the way I want it yet. And uh, it'll be there, though, I promise you. Yeah. And I'm excited that's about that, too. Yeah. I mean, and that's the thing. I mean, we're so grateful. I love what you said, going and growing. Yeah. And we just have kept going. And yeah. sometimes it's just waking up and, and just you got to just keep going through these yeah. difficult times, persevering. And I'm just thankful 
that we are able to keep going and keep yeah. growing. And even your tap dancing, you haven't stopped. We've had to shift a little bit. Yeah. The garage. Well, one other thing to remember, though, we don't have the vaccine yet. So right. as thankful as we are for it coming, we have to be extra cautious at this time. And I know that, you know, people are talking about uh having more cases of the virus than that. Let's just be extra cautious and and be a little patient because it is coming and then we'll have a big party to celebrate. Right. We'll Lots back. of hugs. Lots of hugs. That's right. Oh I missed I the my hugs. first hug, Mama. I miss the hugs. I know. But it's been I, rough. I, I but did it's, get it's... a virtual one from you, Julie. Yes. And uh, from Toto. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, and from Toto. Okay. I'm grateful for this little guy. Oh yes, my yeah, little yeah. companion. Yeah, yes. so much there. to be great. So oh. much to be grateful for. Yeah, I miss him, but I think we'll sign off, Julie. Is that I it? Think, I think that's it. I mean, we can't can't be thankful enough. That's we all can't be. Little... We could be here all day and all night telling you what we're thankful for. Oh, so exactly. We yeah. are just going to plant a few seeds uh, yeah. today, and hopefully, you can take those thoughts and also share maybe around your Zoom dinner table if that's how you're having Thanksgiving. What are you most thankful exactly. for? And Mama, I'm so thankful for you. I just oh. love you, and I'm just I'm... so grateful what we're doing together here every week. Yeah. With your book, I'm so wow. grateful that you're forging on. You're going and growing yeah. with your book. So yeah. I'm thankful for you and for all my children. Yes, um, I tell you, having having your children is the greatest gift. Mm -hmm. I, I not that I can say others aren't, but it it stays with you forever, really. And Absolutely. so I. I wish all of you a happy, happy Thanksgiving. Happy, and happy Thanksgiving. I know that better days are coming for you, too. Absolutely. With better that. days. Next Thanksgiving, we're going to be together. We are. So yeah. it'll be great. Yeah. So just hang in yeah. there and keep going and growing yes. and being thankful and living with an yeah. attitude of thankfulness. She's waving me off. I can't talk anymore. <laughs> I so, I need some of my little Hershey's. And oh, I didn't it's a chocolate yet. emergency. I I was wondering what was going yeah. on over there. When so it's a chocolate emergency. You're you're yeah. cutting me off yeah. for the chocolate. So I you're thinking go down for chocolate. And get them. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> okay. Love everybody. You. Thanks, everybody. Have a happy, happy Thanksgiving. Yes. Be safe and hang in there and keep going yes. and growing. Oh yes. Oh yes. All right. All right. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.